Hey guys, it's Sandy, and in today's nail art tutorial, Julie is going to be showing you how to create this gorgeous watercolor manicure using Sharpies. If you'd like to see more nail hacks like this, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Hi guys, it's Julie. If you're new to the channel, make sure to click the button to subscribe below for new cute polish videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Now let's get started. Start off with a base coat to protect your natural nails. Next, grab your favorite white nail polish and apply it to your accent nails. I'm doing my ring finger and my thumb. Let it completely dry, then you're ready to watercolor. To do the watercolor floral, you're going to need an assortment of permanent markers, isopropyl alcohol, and a brush. Grab your first sharpie and draw in some flower petals. This design is perfect for all you doodlers out there because you can really get creative and draw whatever you want. Now grab a second color and go around the flower petals. This will give a cool watercolor effect later. Now dip your brush into the alcohol and dab once over each petal and watch the magic happen. The colors will move around and bleed together just like real watercolors. And if you need to, you can use your brush to correct the shape of the petals. Next I filled in the surrounding area with smaller flowers in different colors. Layer up the colors to add dimension and give the prints an authentic watercolor look. To finish the floral print, I used a black sharpie and added dots to the middles of the flowers. Because this design is so bold, I finished the rest of my nails off with complementary colors. A bright pink on my index and pinky nail and a sky blue on the middle fingernail. Allow your Sharpie nail plenty of time to dry, then apply a fast drying top coat to seal in your design and add a beautiful shine. Don't forget to click the button to subscribe below and click the info card on the top right of the screen for more cute polish videos. And for more tutorials by me, check the description box for my personal channel.